look at where we are sitting, looking for our daily bread. Toilet now, hope you. You can't, no matter how you went under motor or anywhere there, you piss or you shit. Nowhere you can ease yourself safely that is this for government public toilet. We didn't have it here. Poor sanitation is one of the glaring indicators of urban poverty, epidemics, and poor health, and is globally recognized as being at the root of dozens of fatal contagious diseases, many of which are particularly prevalent among children. Yet in Nigeria, as we have heard, about 116 million people lack decent toilets, 110 million Nigerians like hand washing facilities with soap, and about 40 million practice open defecation. As it is, uh, is to produce uh, policies, workable policies that we push forward the problem that we have and provide a solution to those uh, problems. And the ministry is trying its best in that area. We may continue to give figures, statistic data that this problem exists in Nigeria, but if we are not doing anything to at least solve the problem, the statistic data will be there, keep on increasing every day, but when we plan ahead to see what we can do to solve those problems, I think it will be better for, for us all. Fortunately, the current administration, led by the president, has demonstrated the highest level of political will and commitment to expanding water and sanitation services by declaring a state of emergency in the worst sector. And the launch of the National Action Plan to revitalize the sector. This plan is aimed at accelerating development through five strategic objectives. Decisive and urgent and large-scale action is therefore needed to increase wastewater and fecal sludge uh, treatment, reuse, and recycling. Cities should be empowered to take the lead on a resource uh, revolution with governments and the private sector investing heavily in the infrastructure to enable transition to a circular economy. Mm -hmm.